Welcome to the Cherries TV. <laughs> So cheers to me. My name is Abby and I'm a fragrance lover. I love anything that smells, feels, and smells good. You guys, welcome back to another video. If you are new here on this channel, we talk about fragrances, anything that has to do with smelling good and feeling good, we talk about it here. And if that sounds like something that you're interested in, go ahead and consider subscribing to this channel. All right, guys, so by the title of this video, you already know it's about to get down. We have 10 irresistible fragrances that you should be wearing this fall. All right, guys, these fragrances are irresistible. For me, they're mouth watering whenever I smell them and um, you have to have them. They're must haves. These are 10 irresistible must have fragrances. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that you'll be notified for every single video that I do post guys. So the first one that is extremely irresistible in my collection is one from Sol de Janeiro and it is Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Crush Chirizo 62. I think I'm saying it right. This is a pistachio salted caramel fragrance. It is a body spray, but this lasts for a good three to four hours on the skin. It is really good and they do have the perfume version. So guys, this fragrance right here is one that I go ahead and spray. Oh, mm, I take it and I spray it on other fragrances. I layer a lot of my fragrances with it. And I love to wear it to bed because it is so irresistible. And you already know what I mean about irresistible. Okay, the hubby cannot resist when I wear this fragrance. And I love it. And it's so gourmand. It is mouth watering. Whenever you smell this, it just makes your mouth water. Like, honestly, my mouth is watering right now. That's how good it is. It's like almost edible. I love it, it smells good, and it smells amazing later with any other fragrances, and I like it. So this is one that's very irresistible. The next irresistible fragrance in my collection is one from the house of Oksha, and this one is called Night in Cons. Now, Night in Cons is Oksha's version of Dior Feb Delicieux. Feb Delicieux is a beautiful vanilla, fragrance it is so delicious in the beginning when I first smelled it in my fragrance journey I didn't like it at all I guess my nose was just not used to it because I felt like it was too powdery but now y'all I just can't get enough of this fragrance it is so mouth-watering it is so sexy it's a spicy vanilla more so powdery and warm and just fits perfect for this time of year I love it and Oksha does a really good job with this impression I love it and I have a decant of Feb Delicious. I love it. This is really, really good. Night and Cons by Oksha. Next fragrance is one that's also from Oksha. Now this one is supposedly Rihanna's signature scent with scent, which is Love Don't Be Shy by Killian, but this is Oksha's version of it and this is Sweet Attic. Now Sweet Attic is one of the most prettiest impressions of love don't be shy that i've smelled now i did smell the og love don't be shy the one that came out the first time in the dark black bottle and this is what this smells like now the new love don't be shy is a little bit more watered down and stuff like that but this right here is top notch beautiful last forever once you get it on your skin it is hard to get off i'm gonna go ahead and spray it right here and I instantly smell it. Oh my gosh, it is really good. Um, marshmallow, orange blossom, vanilla, goodness. Mm, Love Don't Be Shy is beautiful. Sweet Attic really did that. The next one is from the House of Alt Fragrances and this is their inspiration of Lost Cherry. Now, I like this better than Lost Cherry. Lost Cherry is so basic for me. This is more in depth and it is called Cherry Smash. Now, one thing I like about this, because you get the, the booziness a little bit more, get that cherry, it is blended to perfection, and it lasts and lasts and lasts. Y'all know Lost Cherry do not last, but Cherry Smash definitely does, and it is so freaking good. Whenever I wear this, people will consistently tell me that I smell good. Cherry Smash is beautiful, it gets you the compliments, and Alt really did a good job with that. It's very irresistible, and I cannot 
cannot not have this in my collection. I love it. I'm very satisfied with this fragrance. Right. Now the next fragrance is one from Novices Perfume and this is called The Embrace. Now this one is from the um, released from Monica Couch. She is a YouTuber here too. This fragrance right here though, oh my gosh, it is so good. It has vanilla in it, it has almonds. It's just really good mouth watering long lasting sweet fragrance whenever i wear this and i've only worn it twice but those two times that i've worn it people really said that I smell so good and i love it y'all it is really really good now when i sprayed this on it reminds me of a freshly baked cake then i'm not talking about any like random cake i'm talking about like rum cake Oh my gosh, because it has some booziness in it and you get that sweetness from the vanilla. Oh, it's so good. So, so good. And that's what this reminds me of. Can't get enough of it. I love it. And Navitas did a really good job. Navitas perfume fragrances are good in general. Like, they haven't done one that I really like, that didn't like. This is good, good. All right, y'all know it wouldn't be an irresistible fragrance without... A Nishane fragrance and this one is a hundred silent ways this right here has like a coffee vibe in it it has like a fruity floral vibe it's more so oriental in my opinion it is beautiful oh it's so sweet whenever I smell this I instantly think of a cappuccino like a caramel cappuccino um, there's this drink that I get from Starbucks. I get uh, brown sugar oat milk, um, shaken coffee, and then on the top, I get the Irish cream foam. Y'all, this reminds me of that so much. And it's the sweetness in this, not even the florals. Take out the florals, just the sweetness. Just reminds me of this. This one gets me compliments. People always compliment me with this. I love this fragrance. It is so good. 100 Silent Ways is really good by itself. And it smells amazing layered with Brazilian Crush. So think about that. If you got these two, go ahead and test it out yourself. The next one is the first time you guys are seeing it on this channel. It is from the house of M. McClef. And it is Note Vanilla. Oh my goodness this is one of my favorite from favorite 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 vanilla fragrances but i never got into my got it in my collection because i don't know why i never got it in my collection but mcclef reached out to me and they were like hey we want to go ahead and send you a fragrance for you to talk about on instagram of course and when i got this fragrance they allowed me to choose i picked this and i was just like oh my god when i finally got it y'all when i tell y'all this is top notch vanilla oh my god talk about a gorgeous vanilla fragrance this is so good i've never smelled anything like it now i do have a lot of vanillas and i could compare it to others but this has its own unique vibe going on there and it's so I had to drink my saliva because it's so good like oh my gosh I love this and it is so gorgeous and my husband like it too when I first got it I wore it to bed and he was just like damn baby and the rest was history <laughs> the next one is one that is very irresistible but it's more so of a fruity gourmand and it is from the house of Burberry and it is Burberry her intense this is such a comforting fruity fragrance mm, 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 mm. And Francis Kirk Dijon made this, so go figure. He's a beautiful blender. Oh my gosh, I love this fragrance. Um, clearly, you can tell that I love it because it's almost done. A couple more sprays and it'll be out of here. I love it. This one reminds me of a beautiful, fruity, creamy fragrance, like, mm, like a fruit cake. Oh my gosh, so good. Imagine like a vanilla pound cake and then you add some strawberries and other fruits on it and you're just eating it like that for breakfast. What? This is what this reminds me of, super irresistible. Like, when I wear these fragrances, I really have to like stop myself because I would just constantly keep on spraying, spraying, spraying. I already overspray, but I would just sit there and spray and spray and spray and spray and spray. And my husband be like, come on, Abby. 
baby stop and i'm like okay sorry <laughs> that is super irresistible is one that y'all have seen me talk about many many times and it's from the house of aaron and it is aaron tangier this is another vanilla this is a beautiful powdery oh i almost put that in my nose a beautiful powdery sweet vanilla fragrance it's more so of on a grown level a gorgeous blend i love this to me this is irresistible like when I tell you irresistible, I love to wear this to bed. And when I get out that fresh, hot, steaming shower, I spray this on my body, honey. Like, can't nobody tell me nothing. Like, you can't tell me nothing. Like, my husband loves this. He really loves when I go to bed with vanilla warm fragrances. It's just, I think it's like a, uh, I don't know. Like, it's just like a booster for him. I love it. I love it. It's good. And the last fragrance is one from the House of Galleria Perfumes. And they sent this to me and it is called Shades of Seduction. Now guys, at first when I sprayed this and I smelled it, I was like, mm, I don't get the seduction part. But when I sprayed it on my skin and I let it settle down, y'all, I just kept sniffing on myself, sniffing. I'm like, oh my God, this is so good. Like I really wanted to like literally take a bite off of my arm because it was just that good. To me, it gives me like this tobacco, vanilla, sexy and Broxton vibe. It gives me that vibe of Baccarat, but it doesn't smell like Baccarat, but like it puts me into that vibe with the Broxton and the Jasmine. Oh my gosh. It is very seductive for real. And you cannot get enough of this. But when you first spray, you're like, okay, well, it smells nice, but what, what is it? Next thing you know, you'll see yourself sniffing and sniffing and sniffing and sniffing and sniffing. That's what this fragrance is all about. I love it, y'all. And it gets me the compliments, too. And it is very unisex, so your husband and your wife can wear it. So. What are your irresistible fragrances? Go ahead and comment them down below. This was mine, and I'll definitely link everything in the description box below for you guys. Thank you so much for joining me here again. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and like the video, comment, and subscribe, because we're on the road to 10K. And without you guys, I know it's not possible. So go ahead and help me push me through, guys. Push me through. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I love you you guys with all my heart thank you thank you thank you thank you please 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 stay safe and keep on smelling fragrances bye <laughs>